It's your lucky day. Today's spot of style is dealing with some elements that are a little dicey. So come get your game on. I'm, re I'm about ready to spotlight some of today's hottest trends in scrapbooking, in crafting, in fashion, and home decor. So come get your spot on with me. Welcome to Spot on Design. I'm Nikki Larson, and today we're dealing with something that's a little dicey. This gaming trend is huge in home decor and in crafting. I can't believe it. Everywhere I look, there's something that has to do with game pieces or cards or anything that has to do with a game. So our primary spot today is on a pair of lamps that I spotted um, at Barbara, Barbara Cosgrove. Dot com, and she has this pair of super shiny, super metallic chess piece lamps that I think are fabulous. They can add a little shine, and plus they can add a little game to your home decor. The secondary spot that I spotted was some dice tables that I saw at Grandin Road. They're super cute, and they're kind of antique -y. There's a red one, there's a black one, um, and I think you can tuck those into any kind of situation next to a sofa, a chair, and get your game on that way. This next spot that I spotted was some wall art and it's some oversized playing cards that kind of have a real old world feel to them. And they are at speakerandcompany.com. And you can go there and look at those. They are super cute. There's ace of diamonds, hearts, clovers, whatever. They have a whole variety of those. So you can put those on your wall and have a little fun. This next spot I was super excited to see because um, growing up, we used to play Crazy Eights all the time. And when we cleaned out my husband's grandma's house, we ran across the deck of playing cards that were the Crazy Eight cards we played, at, we played growing up. So I nabbed those and thought, I am gonna do some scrapbooking pages with those. Well, doing a little research, I have found a Digi scrapbook kit that has these playing cards in them. That's so, so cute. I think they would be awesome on any page. And you can pick those up. It's, it's Solin Studios, and they're at the lilypad.com. Um, and she's got all of the cards in that digi kit. So go check that one out. Okay, for my own home, as I saw this gaming trend coming on, I decided that because I love black and white decor, that I wanted to collect black and white game pieces. And of course, the natural one for me to collect was dominoes. Um, so I started looking around the house and I pulled some game pieces out and started putting them in jars. and. My dad used to get all these domino pieces from trade shows that he'd go to, so I nabbed all his dominoes too. But of course, the dominoes always come with a logo on the back, and for me, that just doesn't work in my home decor. So, if you can see what I've done with these dominoes, I have simply put something on the back. And here's my glittery one. So, they match my home decor. Now, I picked up this glitter tape, which I think I picked it up at Michael's. I think it's by Deja Views, um, and thought that would be fun. And then of course the duct tape, which comes in houndstooth pattern and all sorts of fun patterns. And they've just been waiting for a project. So this one was perfect. So all I did was I basically traced my domino to a pattern. Then I cut out my pattern in the tape. This one's the glitter tape. And then, there it comes. Then you just peel off the backing and stick it to your domino. And then your domino doesn't have that silly logo on the back and you have a stylish little accessory you can put in your jars. So for me, I collected the dominoes, I collect dice, I collect, um, this one's an Uno game that had some fun, colorful game pieces. Um, checkers, these ones, these tri are kind of fun. Um, 
and then this little game had numbers on them. And my kids love to pull these game pieces out and they build with them and they play with them. So it's kind of a fun accessory that they can interact with. And I don't mind if they play with them because they're not gonna break them. So for more information and more inspiring ideas and products on this gaming trend, you can follow my pin board, Get Your Game On. I randomly blog at coca.blogspot.com. And thanks for joining me in the spotlight today on this gaming trend. And remember to roll the dice, collect four, and move four spaces for your winning style. <music>